This is Insider Medicine in 60 from Maryland. Avandia will stay on the market but with a new black box warning. The label will warn of increased risk of angina and heart attack in those who take medications for diabetes. Health Canada's approach went a step further by recommending that Avandia only be used when metformin cannot. From Arizona, female children who enjoy a stable family life may be able to stay children longer as a new study suggests that supportive parents with strong relationships themselves may work to delay the onset of puberty. Early puberty in girls is associated with a variety of health problems such as substance abuse, mood disorders, and cancers of the reproductive system. From Atlanta, new research shows that vaccines created for eight diseases have led to a dramatic reduction of these diseases. While some conditions like diphtheria and measles were essentially eradicated since initiation of the vaccine, other vaccines, such as those targeted against hep B and influenza, were associated with reductions in incidence of 80 to 90 percent. And finally, from Oregon, we may be closer to obtaining a new source of stem cells that could one day usher in a new way to treat many diseases. Researchers were able to take skin cells from a nine-year-old monkey, place them in embryos, and reprogram the cells to clone the original monkey and create a line of stem cells. For Insider Medicine in 60, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.